PCOS Challenge is excited that we're able to provide the public with these wonderful PCOS Awareness Symposia. We're excited at the caliber of the speakers, the experts that are here presenting about the latest in polycystic ovary syndrome. I'm so happy to see so many of you that are on the younger side because it means to me that there's a lot of optimism and a lot of hope. And knowing it now, as opposed to waiting until you're 55 and have a heart attack and find out that it's backing up all the way into PCOS as the base of that, it's an amazing opportunity. We're going to talk about the impact of PCOS as it pertains to infertility related to ovulation problems. We're going to talk about the benefits of lifestyle changes, including diet and exercise. The good news is it can be predicted, it can be anticipated, it can be prevented. The PCOS Awareness Symposium at UCLA has been a phenomenal experience. I am so proud to be part of this. Sasha and her team has put together international people coming in describing the best aspects of PCOS to educate the general population, which is so important. We are also excited about the Sea of Teal. We have hundreds of patients, hundreds of women with PCOS, girls with their parents and couples who have attended this event. Lifestyle healthy living, healthy eating, stress control, what you're putting into your body. I mean, that's from a very non-medical perspective, but just a general practice for every human being. PCOS Challenge has really been able to put together an amazing series of programs that is changing the way we see PCOS across the country and is changing the way patients see themselves. I'm so delighted that PCOS Challenge exists. We have had great difficulty in finding our way to patients who don't understand what's going on with them. It's just wonderful that an organization has developed which can bring information about this condition to the people who don't know about it and who need to know about it the most. PCOS Challenge is excited to further our mission and realize our vision to make PCOS, polycystic ovary syndrome, a public health priority.